Now for altcoins, because I know that's why you're here, we continue to look at the Polkadot universe based on valuation and technical analysis. Polkadot is Web3, and everyone has ignored Web3 all year. So if there's stability in crypto and Evergrande is not a mess, Polkadot has a shot at 46. Polkadot, as of this recording, is probably around 33. Now, looking at altcoins that might be able to survive any decline that could occur, say, between October 13th and October 16th, Alpha comes to mind. I know we've talked about this before, but it really does look like people are buying dips here. Okay, Alpha was a huge crash. A, I, I call it a crash coin. It was a crash coin back in the summer, and now people may be buying dips. They're looking to buy to build an NFT order book. Speaking of order books, PERP, our decentralized derivatives exchange. Now, all year long, everybody on the Token Metrics live stream who right now is hitting the like button because they want altcoin overtime. PERP is a derivatives exchange that actually went up while the market was going down in the summer. There's good support in PERP at 14, and I actually believe people are buying dips here. Looking at the derivatives theme as something that can survive whether the market goes up or down. Token Metrics is a cryptocurrency investment platform that helps users leverage machine learning to become better crypto investors. Our in-depth analysis helps eliminate the emotions of investing, find profitable investment opportunities, and filters out scams. Learn more at tokenmetrics.com.